Yes, I can definitely do more Zara hauls, although I haven't done one officially yet. I said I was going to, but I will try to do that. And then we found out basically almost as soon as I feel like we could, which was a blood test when I was 12 weeks. Yes, I guess you just missed the post I just posted before that, but I just finished filming the gender reveal from our gender reveal party um, that we had. So stay tuned next Wednesday. Definitely we'll be shooting for natural. Um, definitely don't want a C-section. I'm so excited to start this and I know if I just keep putting it off, it'll never happen. So we have ordered a bassinet and we ordered a crib and we're gonna build them and put it in the room and just kind of see what it looks like. So we've already started. Uh, no, we will not be sharing the name. Um, maybe I'll drop a few hints but we're gonna wait till they arrive to tell you the name. So at first I thought that anything I felt was more like gas or air bubbles, but now I've been told that that could be the baby and the little kicks and little flutters could be them. Oh my gosh, I have so many cute things. I did like right after I found out the gender, I hadn't bought anything. And right after I found out the gender, I went like for two days and bought a bunch of stuff, but I actually haven't bought anything since. So it was really just a few days of hauls, but yes. Oh yeah. I mean, I just did a shoot um, four months pregnant and I wasn't supposed to be pregnant. And then two days later, I did a shoot for a maternity brand and I was supposed to be pregnant. So yeah, of course. So yeah, I like that this filter doesn't change my face, but just adds a little color and covers my acne scars. Anyways, not at all. Couldn't care less. Um, I think it's a natural thing. I'm eating whatever I want when I want it. And yeah, I'm not worried. I believe in doing whatever makes you uh, confident and comfortable. And if that is getting a boob job or getting some sort of plastic surgery, then that's your call. It's your body. Um, yeah, I think do what you want to do. But everybody's born beautiful. Well, you're in luck because I literally just filmed an updated skincare routine and a makeup routine and the gender reveal all in one day. So those will be coming up in the next few weeks. This is so hard. Um, lately, there's a few. I've been loving the Hourglass Unlocked Mascara. Obsessed, amazing. I love Charlotte Tilbury's Under Eye Concealer. And um, right, I don't really need a filter. Um, sometimes I like the coloring that it gives me sometimes and most of the time I like when I'm not wearing makeup to just cover my acne scars because I don't like to look at that all the time. So yeah. Thank you. So originally my goal was to be as blonde as possible but as healthy as possible and super cool tones. Um, in the past, last time she did my hair, I actually wanted her to add low light so that the grow out wasn't less of a line. So now she has so now she has added some low lights kind of back here while keeping it really bright on my face, but she bleaches it and then tones it so that it's um, more cool tones. I don't like golden warm tones. I like it more cool. Mm, so many. Um, Joe Stone Crab, Osaka, Komodo, Tiger Tail and Mary, great basics. Um, God, there's so many. Porto Sole, Bellini, 